what is up my beautiful Pisces gang thank you so much for joining me today thank you so much for clicking on this video this is your first time here welcome I am Quisha here with Abundant Healing I was sent here from the universe to give you guys some good messages some good love some good readings some good vibes I was sent here to give it to you and that's exactly what I'm doing so thank you guys so much for joining me today Today we're doing your daily money reading and we do these readings every single day over here at the Millionaire Pisces Club. So if you are a true Pisces and you believe you're going to be a millionaire, if you want channel messages from the universe on how you're going to attract more money into your life and become more abundant, then hit that subscribe button, okay? Because this is the channel for you. And if you are not a true Pisces and you don't believe you can be a millionaire, then guess what? Don't hit the subscribe button because you're missing out, okay? <laughs> So guys, uh, remember that if you want to support the channel, the link is in the description box, AbundantHealingShops.com. Um, also, we have a beautiful self-love mystery box that is available for you guys. The link is in the description. It comes with beautiful stones, um, genuine stones, like the ones you see here. This, this, I just got this. These are exclusive. These bracelets are exclusive, and they will be going in the... Um, the self-love mystery box so yeah go ahead and purchase one and then you'll get some rings you'll get some necklaces you'll get some you know some other essentials for self-love and you know just raising your vibration you know that's what we're all about so go ahead and get your box and um yeah and start raising your vibration and living more you know living living on a high frequency you know you can attract more things in your life when you are um when you are vibrating in a high frequency. So yeah, that's what we're doing. So go ahead, click the link below and get you a self-love mystery box, okay? So let's jump into your reading, honey. I'm not gonna keep you long because you know I get to talking and talking and talking and talking. But yeah, so we're gonna jump right in. Remember that if anything in this video resonate with you to hit that like button, also leave me a comment. Let me know what resonates with you guys. Um, also hit the subscribe button if anything resonated with you because that just means that, you know, this might be your, you know, your channel, you know, there's a lot of readers out there, but you know, you know, some people resonate with me and others don't. And I respect the ones who do, and I still respect the ones who don't, you know? So if this resonates with you, then hit the subscribe button, okay? Let's jump right into your reading. You know, what messages do you have for me to get to the beautiful Pisces collected today in regards to money, in regards to their careers, in regards to their finances, in regards to their income? What messages can I give the Pisces collective today in regards to money, in regards to their job, in regards to their career? What messages can I give the Pisces collective today? Thank you so much, universe. These are the most relevant messages for the Pisces collective today in regards to money. Oh, wow. So, look, I'm not going to take all these cards. There is one card that is on my lap that I'm going to take, but that was a lot. That was just too much. So, this card I'm going to take. I do not read any reversals, or I don't read reversals. Excuse me. Um, just personal preferences. Let's try that again. <laughs> all right. I don't know why so many cards want to come out. And one time, it's like y'all got a lot of good, a lot of energy. It's like y'all energy is strong right now. Okay, I feel it. It's strong, honey. Very strong. All right, give me one more card, universe. Thank you so much. Just wanna, all the cards just wanna come out at the same time. Like, uh -uh. Just give me one more card, universe. Thank you. Thank you. Now I'm trying not to drop them all. I'm trying to be all gentle and stuff. <laughs> okay, I'm going to just pull from the top, okay? Boom. Hello. Chariot showing up at the bottom of the deck, followed by the Eight of Pentacles and the Hanged One. On the top of the deck, we have the Eight of Wands, followed by the Four of Pentacles and the Hierophant. Lots of fast movement coming in, Okay. Lots of willpower. There is a lot of wands. I feel like there's a lot of willpower, a lot of creativity. 
a lot of passion that you have, Pisces. Let's go ahead and start with the Page of Swords here showing up in your most recent past, Pisces. This is telling me that you are, um, you have new ideas, new, um, maybe you have started something new. Maybe your entrance um, has sparked into something new. This is you. Um, this is a new creative idea that you have, Pisces. And I feel like you are wanting to put this idea, um, like I feel like it's in your mind right now, or it was in your mind because it is showing up in your most recent past. So I feel like you, you've had this idea in your mind for a while and it's like, it's new. Maybe it's something that you always wanted to do. Um, you know, maybe you're trying to change your sources of income or maybe you're just wanting to add to your sources of income maybe working at this job or you know this one business that you have um maybe you're finding new ways to um go about marketing your business or you're finding new ways to um just make money because the the page of swords is is like a new some like a new idea that has that has um manifested in your in your thoughts okay showing up here in your current moment you have the seven of wands the seven of wands is telling me that you are taking these new ideas that you are receiving and you are putting them you're putting them into action okay because you're someone here who is very ambitious and very motivated so you go after what you want when you have an idea i feel like you put it forth you put it out into the universe like what you know, when you have a thought, you know, you, you try to, um, maybe you do some research, right? And then you try to try to learn more about it. And then once you have the knowledge that you need, you go forth with this action. Like you don't take your time. You don't procrastinate. I feel like you go forth with this action. The seven of wands is also saying that right now the ground is a little bit rocky or a little bit shaky so maybe this new business or this new uh idea that you have um it's it's a little you know it, it's not going smoothly but it's not going bad you know what i'm saying like <clears throat> like it's it has its ups and downs right if this is a new job you know maybe this is a maybe you started a new job in communications or maybe you started a new job in customer service or you started a new job or a new career where you are um speaking with other people and you are you know um communicating with others you know and 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 it's probably not going um, as smoothly as you thought maybe it's not smooth selling and like I said this could also be a new business this is just I'm just throwing these things out here because this is just what I'm getting um, as as it comes this is what I'm getting it could be a new job it could be a new business because you know everybody is not entrepreneur um, built and everybody is not nine to five built but you have some people who like to work nine to five and you have also have people who like to work um, by themselves and, and and just be an entrepreneur so this message is not geared towards one or the other i feel like it's geared towards both parties it's geared towards both types of people it's not just geared towards entrepreneurs because sometimes my readings be um geared towards just the entrepreneurs um and then sometimes my readings i feel like is geared geared towards um, the ones who work in a corporate job or who has a nine to five job. But in this case, I feel like this is going either way. I feel like you are either at a nine to five job or, you know, a corporate office job or you're doing something um, where you're an entrepreneur and you're starting new businesses and you're, you know, creating new ideas. Or you may be in a nine to five and you're thinking about, you know, starting uh, a new business and becoming an entrepreneur. But whatever the case, I feel like things are not going as well as you want them to go. But the thing with the Seven of Wands is, as you can see, how the Seven of Wands is very, like this is someone who's powerful. This is someone who has willpower. This is someone who is standing their ground, who is not letting the, the 
circumstances break them i feel like you are finding new ways i feel like if something doesn't work for you the way that you want it to work even though the ground is a little shaky you're standing up for what you believe in because this is your passion right this is your passion and you are you know you're you're not letting the the down moments you know that you have you're not letting them um, come along and, and take you off your path and take you away from your vision. You're still allowing your creativeness to shine. You're still allowing your passion to speak for itself. You're still ambition. You know, you're, you're standing up for what it is you believe in. You're standing up for your, um, for your, for, for whatever it is that you're trying to do. It's like, okay, it may not be going the way I want it to go, but I'm just, I'm, I'm not going to give up. You're not giving up. This seven of wands is saying that you're not giving up. Okay. And this is the type of, um, this is the type of energy that you are, that this is the type of energy that is going to help you manifest this into the reality or into your physical realm. Okay. Because persistence and consistent is definitely definitely going to pay off as long as you are consistent with your goals and you are consistent with what it is that you want to achieve you are going to be successful showing up here in your near future you have a victory you have the six of wands the six of wands is screaming in victory the six of wands is saying that yes this is going to pay off all the work all the hard work it, all, the, all of the hard work that you have put into this new idea is paying off you are receiving recognition from others. You know, maybe if you are in a nine to five, you are receiving recognition from your boss. You are receiving recognition from your um, colleagues. You know, this is an entrepreneur. You are receiving recognition from your, um, your business partners, you know, your customers or whoever, your consumers, your, your consumers. <laughs> I can tell that. Excuse me, y'all. Your consumers are happy with the product that you are putting out. They are happy with your business. They are giving you positive feedback. They love what it is that you have to offer. And this wreath right here that's on the top of this wand is symbolizing that it's making you a lot of money. So whatever it is that you are doing, Pisces, you have a lot of money coming in for you. You have a lot of recognition, a lot of acknowledgement. Okay, a lot of rewards that are coming for you in your near future due to you not giving up, due to you standing your ground and you standing up for what you believe in, Pisces, you will have victory. Okay, the victory is yours. There is going to be a celebration of some sort. There is going to be a reward of some sort because you are not giving up on your dream. You are not giving up on your passion. Okay, and you... You're a type of person here who dreams are real to you, you know, because Pisces, we live in a dream world, you know, we live in a uh, fantasy world, a lot of people like to say, which is true, you know, but that's, we, we, we're, we're dreamers, but, you know, a dream without action is just a dream right so we can have dreams all day long but if we don't put them into action then they're just dreams right so we are the type of people who can dream and fantasize about things but as long as you are putting these things into action then you're going to receive the abundance and these dreams are going to become your reality and that's what's happening here for you pisces everything that you are wanting to come is coming to you because you are being consistent and you are being persistent and you are demanding persistence from yourself you are someone here who does not stop at no you do not stop at failure you are someone here who is very confident and you have willpower to keep going you're not giving up okay you don't give up and that is exactly what is going to lead you to the success here Pisces you are definitely on your way to success okay success is definitely going to find you because you're already successful let's just go ahead and just say that you are already successful because look 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 at you look at you you are successful because you are not giving up okay you you are already rich you are already abundant because you don't give up 
because you demand persistence from yourself, you are already successful, Pisces. You know, but you will be receiving your rewards, honey. Your rewards and everything that you are manifesting is going to come to fruition very, very soon, Pisces. This is in your near future. Okay, you're going to be receiving a lot of cash flow coming from this new business or this new venture that you have. You know, maybe you're going to get a raise. Maybe you're going to, um, um, maybe your your business is going to hit new heights, right? Your business is elevating. You know, it's not as smooth selling as you want it to go right now. But as long as you're consistent and you're being persistent and you're demanding that from yourself, then you're going to definitely hit that number. You're going to hit that goal or you may be even exceeding your goals. Okay, but you definitely are going to be victorious, Pisces. Okay, that is the message that I have for you guys. Um, remember to like, comment, and subscribe if anything in this message resonates with you. I would gladly appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. I really appreciate you guys. Remember, if you want to support the channel, you can go ahead and click that link in the description box. Again, I have new merch new things coming in so these will be in your self-love mystery box if you like these bracelets if you like crystals if you like crystal jewelry then go ahead and click that link in the subscription the link in the description the link in the description <laughs> below to get your self-love mystery box if you don't want a box and you just want to get individual jewelry or individual stones you can also do that too so go ahead and click the link abundanthealingshops.com y'all go ahead and show your girl some love i would appreciate it um and that's it y'all thank you so much i love you guys remember to love yourself and um i hope you guys are having a beautiful day all right bye